leadership of Odilo Ujui Municipality recently embarked on a community walk aimed at creating awareness and generating buzz around the highly anticipated sports fiesta. Council staff and community members in large numbers commenced the walk at the council secretariat, traversing multiple localities in the LCDA. Participating council staff and community members said the walk aimed at enrouding the upcoming sports fiesta and the end of the year's activities, underscoring the importance of positive engagement and regular exercise for overall well-being. The chairman is promoting sports, is promoting um, grassroots um, talent on discovery, and you also agree with me that a lot of young people we, in our local government are, are, are now assets to the, to the state to the, and to Nigeria. Um, some of them even represented the Lagos State that they just concluded um, youth sports fe um, um, festival at Asaba. And a lot of them have been representing Nigeria at West African Games too. So this shows that um, the, 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 the initiative by the local government chairman to continue to discover talent at the grassroots is something that is commendable. And as the chairman of the National East Council of Nigeria, I'm here to come and support him and to let him know that at the state level, we are also going to um, amplify the advocacy in support of grassroots um, sports um, sports programs. We are trying to engage with our community, bringing sports, bringing fitness, and of course, work is very, very important. Some of, some of us here, this is the only time they get the time to exercise in the whole of the year, so they are always looking forward to that work of the year. So it's like we've been increasing the lifespan of our old ones, because most of them will not get the opportunity to work like this, instead of doing campaigns or something like that. So it's a very important work for everybody in Odeolo. You can see the youth are enjoying the work, the adults are just all age groups are covered in the work. So it's what brings everybody together. It's someone that carries youth along when it comes to a chairman. So uh, he has That's done a lot for the for the youth of Odiolo community So for the even when it comes to basketball specifically, he has done a lot for us. In order to live long, eh, you must emulate um, exercise, do your exercise. For example, in the morning, I wake up by 6 o'clock. My house is uh, on the other side. I will climb that beach at uh, Vono Close. I climb it three times. After three times, I now go to the gym to go and do some normal things. I return to my house by 7. That is why I am much, much fitter than you. This is a wonderful, great, commendable initiative coming out of the community. And it's part of community building and community cohesion. It, it helps not only to develop the capacity, to enhance the productive capacity of our population, it also gives them the opportunity to live longer life, to be more productive at work, to be more productive in school, to rest well, to escape from diseases. So it is believed that if something like this is going on in several communities, we will see impact in our socio-economic development. Because our economy is dependent on people, because our economy is dependent on people, it is only healthy, active, strong, viral, energetic population that can impact on socio-economic development. Council Chairman Razak Ajala stated that the Sports Fiesta will uncover and nurture young talent, while the work will promote positive community engagement and fitness. Of course, the whole essence of this program is to create a platform to identify the to identify the sport potentials in our in our youth and to also use the platform to project and to promote them to the world thereby using this mentality of our position to give them meaningful and sustainable empowerment the work for sustainable development the step in the right direction towards promoting sport development and social cohesion in Nojilu Ujiwe municipality.